Hello everyone, this is Spot. Welcome back to Techno Babylon. Wow, I recorded so many episodes last time that it's actually been a while since I recorded any of this. Um, and uh, yeah, so we're going to get back to it. If you remember the last one, we, we did the whole thing in the trance with the other girl and finding out that she she had the, the, the whole sync ability that was more than, you know, anyone else. And uh, God, I hope that didn't. I just had to click something off screen and... The game went bleep for a second, so hopefully it wasn't too bad. Um, anyway, and we came back here and we talked to Nina over here, um, who's um, kind of hot, actually. Um, and smart, obviously, or she wouldn't be working here, which is even hotter. So, yeah, we're going to... We're supposed to be doing something. I think we're looking at the microscope here. Looks like oh, the engineered nerve go. tissue is as robust as we'd hoped. Self-maintenance. That's the big benefit of organic hardware. Gingineered. I'll never get used to that. Sounds so corny. Uh, okay. Can it wait? I'm in the middle with the fMRI scan. All right. Sorry, lady. Okay, so we've got the microscope. I don't know what we're supposed to do here. What? There's no quest information. Crazy. Okay. Um. Doctor Vargas. And here, my dear. What are you doing? Roadman 9 and 46. Dr. Chigwa is mapping my brain activity. In many ways, our product will share more in common with us than other computer platforms. Intermittent rostrocaudal axis patterns. Of Tell course, me, yes. what do you think would be the best manner to train such an AI? Um, naturally. Naturally. It can handle abstractions better than conventional AI. Plus, we have millennia of experience and tradition when it comes to education. I somewhat agree with you. Do you hear that, Gwen? Mm-hmm. Though Dr. Chigwa agrees that conventional programming is impossible, she is considering the possibility of imprinting existing mind states within the platform. Quick for the AI, but utilizing a person's natural experience? Though it may not be my philosophical ideal, it is an intriguing experiment. Ah. It is good to hmm. be working with you again, Dr. Pereira. I mean, Dr. Regis. Congratulations again on the wedding. Um. It's been too long since Buenos Aires, Eduardo. You were my brightest student, Fiksha. I felt so conflicted when you were awarded that field position. That feels like so long ago. I was ready for something more sedentary. And this project, it's like nothing else I've ever worked on before. It's groundbreaking, the next big step in artificial intelligence. Hmm, thank you for recruiting Charlie. You found quite a team. You must have made some friends in government. We'll do this you must one. have made some powerful friends in Newton since you left Buenos Aires. I'm surprised they didn't just contract this AI project out to corporate research. The fear then is dependence upon the private sector in all future matters. However, if we should not succeed, that will be their next option. But that's not going to happen, is it? I am afraid that we have hit an obstacle. Though we have a solid theoretical groundwork, we cannot proceed. Why not? We've built a gene map for the organic processors. Get Charlie or Dr. Chigwa to run it through a flash clone. Alas, that is where our problem lies. Our plans depend upon the development of neural tissue. The flash clones develop with none for legal and ethical reasons. Hmm. Hmm. Simulation? Dr. Baxter has a reliable simulation of the AI running in C2. Surely he can pattern it out onto a larger system. While the platform will run magnificently in an organic framework, trying to emulate it in a simulation has tremendous processing costs. Unless we can finalize the I production of an organic matrix, we will fail. Do, do. Dr. Baxter oh, has oh, a reliable... No, oh, sorry. While they try I clicked the wrong one. Right. The city council must have expected something like this eventually. We can petition for a special exception. They'll provide live embryos for research. Certainly possible, though too lengthy. By the time approval has been granted, the project will have exceeded its deadline. Okay. There might be another option. Nina gave me the idea. We need normal embryos to engineer, not the flash clones, right? That is our problem. The council will not be able to provide them quickly enough. Well... Charlie and I have been trying for kids. As a result, we have several fertilized embryos frozen. Viksha, I hope you are saying what I think. We could 
perhaps donate? You do not know what this could mean to us. Mm. You have saved us, Miksha. In a way, you may yet be the surrogate mother of the central AI. Okay, that would be Whoa, creepy. Oh, big spike in activity there. You think Charlie will be okay with that? Hey, he spent years modifying embryos himself. I'm sure he'll be all right. Maybe not. Flesh drive. You got in? Yeah. Now to find out who our mysterious benefactor is. Good luck. I'll keep the car moving. Hopefully Central won't start asking too many questions. Copy that. Regis out. Are you Dr. Regis? Yes. You must be the welcoming committee. They're waiting for you upstairs. Hold on. Gotta search you first. If that's what it takes. One cell issue charge pistol. It will be kept safely for you until business is concluded. Gee, thanks. You may proceed upstairs. Oh, Lord. Nina, you're the one I've been talking to. You made it at last, Charlie. How are you? Hmm. If I'd known it was you in my head, I'd never have agreed to come. Now, Charlie, that's not fair. Let's put the past behind us. What happened to Vicky affected us all. You've got some nerve, if you think... In fact, the reason I've invited you is to help fix mistakes arising from the project. What do you mean? Allow me to introduce everyone here. Councilman Dean. Good evening, Dr. Regis. Ran Schumann. He don't look like much. Imogen Natalia Ravilla Quintanilla de Flores. What? Charmed, I'm sure. And I believe you've already spoken to Mr. Stepford here. Oh my, yes. All of us are here because of a common cause. The removal oh, of Central. What? I mean, you can't just... It's a difficult proposition, and we need the help of someone like yourself. In exchange, we have the means to assist you with your personal crisis. You've always dreamed big, haven't you, Nina? We know exactly where your offspring are. Don't dismiss us outright. We can help each other, Charlie. Listen to what we have to say. Hmm. Okay. Hey, bodyguard. Hello? Though obscured by his dark glasses, you can tell that the guard is staring right through you. Apparently, conversation is not his priority. Hmm. Okay, so other than people, what do we have here? Go have the table. Same table. Councilman Dean, who's on the other side of the table for some reason. Cooler. The cabinet is locked, likely to prevent guests simply helping themselves. That would be kind of strange in a place this nice. Is there any place to go over there? No. Let's look at the table. It might be presumptuous to be the first to sit down for dinner. Okay. Let's right click on the cooler. The chiller lined with wine bottles stands with a window. Okay. Wine bottles. Interesting. Table. It looks like the waiters are preparing the process of setting up. The waiters are in the process of setting up appetizers. Wait. What? Okay. Anyway. I guess we just start, we'll go from left to right. Imogen. Good evening, Miss. Dame Imogen Natalia Ravia Quintanilla de Flores. Uh, yeah, right. yeah, that. You may call me Imogen, darling. Thank you. If you don't mind my saying, you don't look like any conspirator I've ever seen before. Thank you, darling. It's my own unique style. I'm sure Nina's got a use for everyone here. What part are you playing in her plan? All we ever do in life is play a role, Dr. Regis. I promised I would assist her when she required. And thus, here I am. Not as heavy muscle, I guess. I am very good at networking, Dr. Regis. I taught her everything she knows about it. I lend credibility to her mission with my very presence. Hmm. What do you I could understand why some people would want Central removed. The kinds of folks who see it as an obstacle to their work. But what good would it do a celebrity like yourself? You think in such cynical terms, Dr. Regis. It benefits me because it benefits dear Nina. You're doing this out of altruism? Is that so surprising, Dr. Regis? Frankly, it is. Hmm. I wonder if they're together. Do you know Dr. Jong? Of course, darling. You go back a long way? One might say that. We were lovers, uh -huh. Dr. Regis. Oh, there you go. I, uh... My, they said you came from backwards parts, but I hadn't quite expected a display like this. Forgive me, Miss Flores. I just find it hard to picture Dr. Jong loving anything. 
We were close. Close enough that I came to her aid now that she needs it. Interesting. You knew Gil Vanderwall as well? Only within this gathering. I had no use for his services in... talent acquisition. You mean facilitating criminal skills with buyers? Indeed. His history in the underworld sounded so... thrilling. But personally, he was so dull. Everything was business to him. That husband of his, on the other hand. Hmm. Alright. Oh, so she's bi. Uh, not that it matters. Just, well, it might matter. I don't know. So I hear you're a... celebrity? Oh, Dr. Regis, such an understatement. You'll have to forgive me, Miss Flores. I'm not big on pop culture. How refreshing. It's such a shame what the Nets doing to the young of today. Though if it wasn't, I wouldn't have nearly the profile I do. So, what do you do, exactly? I come from a wide background of European nobility. But I can do anything that's asked of me, my dear. Music, talent contests, endorsements. So essentially, you're famous for being famous? Precisely. <laughs> Though much of the work is so tiresome, darling. I delegate a great deal to simulations, lookalikes, and synthetics. That's all for now, Miss Flores. Please, darling. Just Imogen. Okay, well, she's, she's a piece of work, right? Um... Mr. Ron. What you want? What's your part in this conspiracy? Dr. John wants to capture biggest AI in the world. It's going to take enormous memory and processor. And you're going to furnish her with these? With all the capital she need. Money, guns, labor. Why? It sounds like you're on board with her plan. What do you get out of it? Newton is lousy place to do business, Regis. You reckon it's Central's fault? Central watches too close. Is you he can't mafia? bribe anyone, you mean. Exactly. Can't make things work. Sometimes it's nice not to have a government driven by the wealthy. <laughs> we will control New Central. It's a great opportunity for us. Interesting. You're one of the richest men in Greater Han, aren't you? Damn straight. What are you doing here? I like this restaurant. I suggest it. No, I mean, why in person? At this meeting? That is how we always do it. Cannot trust anyone else. Other people stupid. I agree with if that. too many people know, then Central will find out. What sort of business do you run? Some of everything. Factory, guns, biochem, industry farming. Pretty A diversified. manager there too? Hell no. Give that job to cousins. You have a Sihan? is lousy country. Everything poisoned. Sky is black. Maybe it's all those factories you're running. That was a bit of a stab. What do you think of Dr. Jong? She's very clever. She know what she's doing. I worked with her in the past. I guarantee the only ones she's looking out for are her and her plans. So, that's how to get ahead. Cooperation happen when we want same thing. I want Central gone. She wants Central gone. Don't say I didn't warn you. Did you know Gil Vanderwall? Sure, everyone here know Gil. We work together. He have connections everywhere. He was a middleman for criminals. Exactly. Any specialist he could find. Even mind jackers, Dr. Regis. What do you know about Giel's links to the mind jacker? Vanderwall set people up with specialist talent, famous for it. In this case, a third party needed a mind jacker. He fixed that up for them, got the best. But eventually, he discovered something that made him regret introducing them? He found what the client's plans were in the long run. If they succeed, our plan to remove Central will fail. So he tried to stop the Mindjacker. Exactly. Took the memory module he was using to store minds of his targets. And it cost him his life. Pity he's working against us. Good Mindjackers are hard to find. True. Who hired the True. Mindjacker from Vanderwall. <sighs> like everything else. Information is not free, Regis. I'll get back to you. Stop wasting my time. Well, he's pleasant. Let's go for the councilman. Dr. Regis, how can I help? This looks You're on the city council, aren't you? Indeed I am, Dr. Regis. Rep for the Southwest Ward and co-chair of the Cosmopolitan Party. I remember when you got elected. 
They called you Mr. Incorruptible. I never got that. That's because of the device in my head, Dr. Regis. What is that in your head, Counselor? Why, it's a neural governor, Dr. Regis. As in, what paroled felons are fitted with? Similar. While most of those are designed to limit violent behavior, mine prevents me from lying. Thoughts of deceit are met with tremendous pain. Were you inside? Oh, my no. This was a voluntary choice. After all, most governors are subdermal. I wanted my constituents to see it as a sign of my integrity. I knew someone with one. Dr. Baxter. I recall reading about his release last month. I thought it must have malfunctioned, so, that he was out for revenge. Turns out he's just dead. It's like someone just inherited his hatred. So does this guy's does this guy's governor, mental governor, does it actually work? Or does it just look like he has it? Hmm? Hmm? Just to let you know, I voted for the other guy. Oh uh, well, that's your prerogative. Any concerns I might be able to address for next time? I guess I've always voted Metro, since I lived here. Ah, inertia. Something difficult to overcome. Give our site a read. You might find you agree with us more than you think. Interesting. I'm surprised to see a city councilor in a conspiracy like this. Desperate times call for desperate measures, Dr. Regis. I guess you've been facilitating things for the plot. Much as it pains me to misuse my position, that is the case. I've been able to expedite import permits for equipment necessary to Dr. Zhang's plans. And Central hasn't noticed? In my role, I'm given considerably more privacy than the average civil servant. No offense, Doctor. None taken. I just cover the camera in my office with paste. <laughs> so, I understand what you're doing for it, but why? How does someone in government decide that Central needs removing? I've read your bio, Dr. Regis. I know that you have no great love for Central. But, in practical terms, I believe it has become a threat to our democratic society. A threat? How so? Over the course of its 20 years of operation, Central has begun to develop opinions. Uh -oh. For an individual to have done so is natural. For an AI, it is impressive. But in its position, coordinating the actions of government, it poses a risk. Yep. Wouldn't someone notice? Call it out? There isn't enough to address as yet. It's clever. It's designed to carry out the policies of the council, and it cannot fail to do so. But it can drag its metaphorical feet, badly implement plans it disagrees with, You've seen it do this. I've had suspicions. Dr. Zhang's research confirms the extent to which Central is developing its own conscience. I believe that you yourself recently had a disagreement with it over its handling of a crisis. Another bombing? Hmm. Central has done well, but there exist many other options today that are equally valid. We need a system that will effectively manage the city and carry out its instructions, not one that cherry-picks what policies it believes appropriate. Interesting. How did you get on board with Nina? I and others in the Cosmopolitan Party have suspected changes in Central's behavior. We sought the assistance of one of its original creators. Obviously not Vargas. He loves that thing. Indeed. Her research confirmed that, thanks to the scale of its operations, Central has been able to form its own opinion on the ideal state of affairs, regardless of the democratic consensus. So when she said that she would remove Central... It was a difficult decision, but we had to take it. Central's replacement will carry out its role more appropriately. And Nina will get to continue her research on Central. Why haven't you simply raised this in the Council? Can you imagine what that would mean? Political suicide. Not just for myself, but it would undermine confidence in Newton's world-leading AI industries. True. I keep looking at this thing up here on the ceiling and it keeps, <laughs> it keeps reminding me of the radiation symbol. Just like on it, you know, on angle. Ugh, messing with me. Did you know Gil Vanderwall? Indeed I did. He was a big donor in politics all over Africa. And you knew about what he did? His criminal connections? I'm the one who introduced him to the group. I'm also aware that he introduced the mindjacker you're after to his current employer. You know about that? You will need our help to find him. And we need your help to stop him. And Central. I'll get back to you, Counselor. Anything I can do to help, Dr. Very Richardson? interesting. Hmm... All right. Still can't do anything with the table. Is there anywhere else we can go? The table just... Okay, so we've still got stuff right here. Oh my, yes. Oh my. Oh my, yes. Actually, can I can I not talk to the waiter? Oh, wait, wait, hold on. I can't. Hey, you all right? He stares at you and you feel a strange mix of fear and contempt within his glare. You realize, to your horror... 
that you've seen those eyes before, only a few days earlier. Okay, that's creepy. Everyone, take cover! Uh-oh, it's the bomber. <gasps> oh, no. Is anyone hurt? The bodyguard lost his face. Try to kill us! Guards! Shut up, Ron. You're still alive, aren't you? It appears that poor Imogen is the only one injured. Wow, she's really sorry. injured. She's dead. I knew it! You trying to kill me! All of you! Calm down, Ron. You don't know who was behind this. Actually, he has a point. All those who knew about this meeting are in this room. Except, of course, for Charlie. He only joined us at the last moment. Dr. Regis, will you lend us your skill as an investigator? Yeah, you find who tried to kill me! Do this for us, Charlie, and we'll give you everything. We can tell you who has your kids and exactly where he is. Fine. Just remember, I'm not doing this for your sake. Okay. Someone here almost killed I me as well. I think this is kind of obvious. Thank you anyway, Charlie. Central did it. I think Central did it. I, yeah. And I'm going to put a cut in this video. And in the next one, we're going to figure this thing out because that is a very rude AI. It's not good when AI... When AI is try, starting to bomb people... You know that things might start to be getting out of hand. So I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. We're going for the moon. Hey there, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you'd like to see more, just click subscribe. Come say hi to me on Twitter, Facebook, Tumblr, any of those. I hope to see you next time.